。你好，朋友。你好 ，Brian 斑马。And welcome to another edition of Mini Lessons with Lao Shi. Today we are going to review some Chuntian words from last our last video, and we are also going to learn some Yanse, some new colors in Mandarin. Brian Ban Ma, 你喜欢什么季节？我喜欢。春天，你喜欢春天。春天。Remember last time we learned that 春天 meant spring. Can you try and say that? 春天。Brian 斑马 ，Do you want to review some 春天 words, some vocab? With our Peng Yo, okay. Brian Ban Ma is going to say a word in Mandarin that we learned last week on our video, and I would like you to see if you can guess what the word means in English before I give you the answer. Are you ready? All right, Brian. What is our first word? You say it twice, and I'll repeat it, and then we'll give our Peng Yo. Three seconds to guess. You ready? Hua, 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 hua. San, er, e, ling. Okay. If you guessed hua meant flower, then you did a great job. All right, Brian. Give our Peng Yo their second word. 鸟，鸟，鸟，鸟，三，二，一，零。If you guessed 鸟 meant bird, then you are correct. Okay, time for our third word. You ready, Brian Bama? 蜜蜂。蜜蜂，蜜蜂，蜜蜂 is our third word. 三，二，一，零 If you said 蜜蜂 meant bee, then you did a beautiful job. Okay. Our last word for today, Brian, and this is going to be our word that's going to lead into our lesson for today. 彩虹，彩虹 Okay, our word is 彩虹，彩虹三，二，一，零 If you said 彩虹 is a Rainbow. Then you are correct. So, what are we going to learn about today, Brian? 颜色，颜色，颜色 Can you say that? Means color in Chinese, and we are going to learn today the 颜色 of the 彩虹，彩虹 So let's go ahead and get started. Brian Ban Ma, what have you got there? Oh, it says 彩虹的颜色 colors of the rainbow. Let's get started with our first 颜色 Our first color is. 紫色，紫色。Can you say that? Hmm. Let's see what examples we have on here for 紫色。紫色的葡萄。Remember that word from our video on 水果 and 蔬菜，葡萄。紫色的
葡萄，紫色的葡萄。Can you try it? Okay, our next color is 蓝色，蓝色。Brian 斑马 ，What examples do we have for 蓝色 ？Oh, look right there. A 水果 that we learned during our 水果蔬菜 lesson. 蓝莓，蓝莓。Do you already hear the word 蓝？ As in lanza in the fruit name. Also, we have a word from our Chuntian lesson. Feng Zheng, lanza 的 Feng Zheng, lanza 的 Feng Zheng. Okay, Brian Ba Ma, let's go to our next 颜色 Lusa, lusa. Can you say that? Lusa is the color green. What examples can we see on this picture? Oh, we see shoe, shoe, lusa da shoe, lusa da shoe. Hmm. What else can we see? Oh, chingwa, chingwa, lu se de chingwa, lu se de chingwa. Okay. After lu se, what's next? Huang se, Huang se. Can you try? Huang se is yellow. Hmm. What examples can we see that we already know? Taiyang, Huang se de Taiyang, Huang se de Taiyang. Hmm. Anything else? Oh yeah. There's Niao. 黄色的鸟，黄色的鸟。Okay, what's next? 橙色，橙色。Can you try? 橙色 is the color orange. And what examples do we have of 橙色 Hu luo bo. So we can say 橙色的胡萝卜，橙色的胡萝卜。Hmm. Anything else? Oh, 蝴蝶，蝴蝶，橙色的蝴蝶。橙色的蝴蝶。Okay, how many colors do we have left? 一个。Okay, what's our next one? 黄色，黄色。Can you try? 苹果，苹果。So we can say, 黄色的苹果，黄色的苹果。Okay, anything else? 新，新。We can say, 黄色的新，黄色的。Shin. Great job, guys! Now we can say all the colors of the Tai Hong. Take a look. We have 紫色蓝色
绿色、黄色、橙色 and 红色 And together they make 彩虹的颜色 the colors of the rainbow. So, 朋友 this week what I'd like you to do is practice saying your 颜色 Look around you and see what you can see. Try to name the different colors using Mandarin and using the words that we learned this week. Then let me know how it goes. 再见，朋友。